Excited about winning the game, uh, coming back off of a, uh, you know, two road trips where we were one and one, um, and then coming off the loss this past week, we wanted to get back out and obviously uh, work hard uh, this week in practice. The kids did that. Had no idea really what to expect with Austin P uh, because they had such a tough schedule. Played three ranked teams and then they played uh, Memphis. Uh, but I really thought our players came out and took control of the game in the first quarter. Uh, wins a win, and uh, we're five and two heading uh, into conference play. Uh, it was huge because um, if you look at the other games they had, I think Eastern Kentucky was only up seven nothing at halftime, fourteen six, Chattanooga. It was good to get up, get up on them, especially from last week. We're going not having our best offensive day. You know, our offense we had a good drive to, to start the game. Uh, had a lot of big plays in there, and then of course uh, they punted the ball, and Chandler Cur Curtis uh, caught it, and uh, when he catches it, uh, good things happen. And I was I was happy that. Uh, Chandler was able to, I think he had four catches, he had a rush one time, uh, so we were able to get him the ball a little bit more, uh, but uh, people were starting to kick it away from him, as you saw in all the kickoffs, they were either kicking it uh, to our other returner or our squib kicking it, so we're going to get a lot of those kicks from here on out, but uh, when he gets his hands on it, things, exciting things happen. I really thought that early on in the first quarter we smothered them uh, on, the, on the defensive side of the ball, and, and really and truly, uh, you know, we, we had a good plan going in, our guys played hard. Uh, they really hit us with a couple of little uh, inside runs that uh, we've got to shore up. But uh, overall, I thought we did a solid job of containing them. I have the uh, highest confidence in Marvin. I know that they can uh, make the blocks necessary and all of that. And uh, we know that Western Carolina is a good team. They have a good defense. So we're going to have to prepare all week and uh, come ready to play. 5-2 and and playing well uh, going into pretty much a conference stretch. I think we've got uh, the next to last game, we've got a non-conference opponent. But, uh, Everything from here on out is going to be conference games and a lot of things are going to be decided in the next three or four weeks.